Okay. So, first things first, welcome back to another fragrance video, a review. Um, what you're seeing in front of you right now is a sample box from an independent fragrance house based out of um, Maryland here in the United States. Um, it is a black owned, single man operated and self taught perfumer. Um, he goes by the name of Zach Ninve and his fragrance house is Maison de Darius. Okay. <laughs> and this particular fragrance, Anor, this is a sample that I purchased from him. There will be a link down in the description where you can check out his fragrances. I purchased this earlier this year and a uh, fellow YouTuber who was on an Instagram live, Mr. Cologne76, I'll also leave a link to his YouTube channel. Um, he was on an Instagram live and he was talking about uh, the fragrances that are available at this fragrance house. Now, this is sometime in February, and that's Black History Month. Um, I, I made sure to take down uh, as much information about these perfume brands that he was interviewing as possible and supporting them throughout the year. So, Maison de Darius happened to be one that I decided to check out. I purchased a sample of Anor and of another fragrance that he has called Meraki, which is also an amazing fragrance. But right now, we're reviewing Anor. This fragrance blew me away. It absolutely floored me. Um, if you follow me over on Instagram, um, then you would have saw my face on review. And it's one of the first times that I went on camera and said, you know, I really got to talk about how much I like this. Um, <laughs> the uh, Accord, um, a fragrance that this presented, uh, it blew me away. And... <clears throat> I could tell immediately that I was going to get a full bottle of the fragrance that uh, I sampled. Um, I decided to get myself a 30 ml bottle, which will run 165 US dollars. Um, I'm not certain if this is going to be discontinued or not. I heard at one point that it might be for the new line that he has coming. Um, I'm not sure. Don't quote me on that because they're still available on his website as I'm recording this. But this is the Anor bottle. Let me give you the notes. Uh, grapefruit, oud, patchouli, rose. There goes that rose again. I love rose. Sandalwood and vanilla. And what does that smell like? The Accord comes together and you can immediately tell that there is oud in this fragrance. Um, here's a spray from the atomizer. Man, nice distribution on the atomizer. And this is extract concentration. I don't know if you see how oily that spray is. This is extract concentration, which means that there is about... Uh, 18 to 20 percent perfume oil concentration in here this is a rich fragrance it's a beast fragrance the siage trail the performance is going to impress you <sighs> it smells incredible at the top you can tell that there's a fruit note the grapefruit accord that he created for this fragrance that he uses in this fragrance is absolutely wonderful. I thoroughly enjoy the opening of this because it's oudy, but your typical oud fragrances are oud rose mixes, and generally they have a similar scent. This oud rose combination is still flowing in with just about every single note into a, a a blended accord you can't necessarily pick some of these notes out 
the fruitiness you can tell it's from the grapefruit and that oud rose accord blended with that fruitiness smells absolutely captivating <clears throat> this is a fragrance that i would recommend to people that are shy when it comes to fragrances with oud in it um i'm not sure what kind of oud wood is used in here um it could be as soft as Gayak wood, but if I'm being completely honest, this is just a masterful, masterful, self-taught blend. Um, I enjoyed wearing this for a full day or two um, before I had gotten enough information to make this review. Uh, and when I wore it... I unfortunately didn't get any compliments, but I also, it was also pretty cold out, so there wasn't really uh, many people outside. You're going to get, or I got, very nice performance with this fragrance. I got about eight hours on skin before the dry down started. This is going to perform. At about the eight hour mark, what you're left with is going to be a less intense version of this fragrance the fruitiness from the grapefruit dies down it's gonna smell of vanilla patchouli floral soft sandalwoody it's hard to say one way or the other where it's gonna lean when it goes into the dry down because the blending again is just so amazing it <sighs> this fragrance thoroughly impressed me uh i recommend you getting a sample if you're curious these samples are 5 ml they run for $30.99 I purchased two of them. Uh, I think the sample that is in here is empty, but of course I've got the full bottle. Highly recommend that you check out this independent black owned perfume house. You won't be disappointed. I cannot say enough how satisfied I am and how I look forward to purchasing Meraki when it becomes available as a full buy. Thanks for watching this video. I appreciate you for checking out my content. Let me know in the comments down below if you've tried Maison de Darius or if you're interested. I'll see you in the next video.